and believe this one. Okay. So, uh, good morning, everyone, again. So, is it visible? Okay, good, good. Um, so, yeah. Um, so, today's, uh, so this week, we're going to be working on uh, Tinder. Uh, Tinder. And we're going to be using AI for uh, developing the Tinder document and applying it. So, uh, it's going to be a great project. Let's go through uh, the introduction. Okay. Okay, so the project scenario, um, you're going to be uh, working for uh, a company called uh, Protec Solution, which is a sol solution provider in the uh, technology, and uh, it's just uh, that enhances operational efficiency and drives in innovation. So um, you are uh, going to be working as a project manager, as a, as a PM, and you're going to create a bit document for this tender. So it's a company, it's called uh, GIZ. It's a German company. Um, and you're gonna, it has uh, invited you to uh, bid. So you're gonna create a bid document and uh, apply it. So you're gonna be using AI for this uh, project as well. Uh, so if I am not uh, audible, please uh, make sure to just raise your hand uh, or yeah, speak. Okay, so uh, your job is going to be to prepare uh, all the parts for the bid document and ensure uh, every do document has a high quality because it's an international company and meet all the requirements that is stated in the uh, bid document and you're going to be showing the, your company's uh, strengths and expertise. So uh, when you specify the, this week's project, the objective of this week's project is going to be the first one is uh, de to develop the BIT document. You're going to create a high quality uh, document uh, that shows the qualification and experience of uh, your team and you're going to be using AI in order to just create the draft and um, uh, you're going to do the edits and after that you're going to use AI to just check the quality and clarity of the, the documents. And you're going to be collecting CVs because uh, in the bid uh, that the Tinder shows, uh, there is a list of expertise that are uh, needed. So you're going to be creating CVs for them and for yourself as a project ma manager in order to uh, meet the qualifications of that bid. So uh, that you must ensure that all CVs uh, meet the requirement of the Tinder. So the Tinder, uh, when uh, they release the bid, uh, when they release the document, there is a list of expertise that are required. And you're going to be making sure that uh, every position is filled with relevant experience and skills, including yourself, of course, as a project ma manager. So, yeah, you're going to be using AI, as I mentioned earlier, to create and refine uh, the Tinder documents. And uh, if this is, uh, most of this is going to be new for mo most of us. So you can use AI to just understand the Tinder documents because it might be a long thing, a long document sometimes. And you're going to be uh, using uh, the like AI in order to just understand it and interpret it. And at last, you're going to be developing the project budget and you're going to use AI in order to draft, in order to create a draft of the project, uh, the project, the budget projection for the project. So, um, is that clear, guys? So uh, the expected outcomes are uh, create uh, learning how to create uh, bid documents, how to include CVs for a proposal uh, for the bid, uh, learn to how to assemble uh, the project budget, and using AI to draft the bid do do documents, uh, project budget, and so on. So uh, is that clear so, so far, guys? 
good, good. Okay, so let's go to the details. So on, on the task one, uh, you're going to be working on uh, just uh, uh, understanding the TOR or the term of reference. And every document you have around um, nine documents that we have provided you with. So these documents are essential for BID. So you're going to go through them and just understand them. Yeah, or you can use AI in order to help you understand more. And you're going to uh, create a document uh, with a, this structure. So this is going to be your bid document. I, after going through each uh, each of the document that we have provided, you can then draft your bid uh, document. So your bid document is going to have an executive side summary, uh, which overviews your company, uh, the project plan, uh, this depends on uh, the term of reference. You can find the project plan there, the methodology and approach, which uh, this is going to highlight uh, what's, uh, what ways or wh which approach you're going to use in order to uh, fulfill the request of the tender. Having team qual qualification, as we have uh, like mentioned earlier, uh, you're going to be collecting CVs of your team and of your, yourself. That's going to match the qualification of the bid. So uh, you're going to highlight it here. And the previous experience is also going to be extracted from that. And risk ma management plan, you know, you're going to be identifying uh, potential risk and uh, how you're going to be resolving them. Uh, and the financial proposal, just uh, cost breakdown of uh, the finances. And uh, don't worry about the, I, I know it's, it could be a lot, but we can have an introduction about these uh, files in the afternoon. So yeah, so you, you're gonna be using AI tools just to have an understanding of the, the documents. And for the bit, you can use AI in order to draft the initial <clears throat> version for each set section. And then you're going to just refine and uh, edit the uh, generated draft by yourself and just ensure that they are clear, accurate, and alignment with the requirements. You can find these requirements in the TOR and other documents. So including the team CV, so you're gonna collect uh, the CVs on task two and gather uh, for the team and for yourself, of course. So the roles are going to be uh, such as IT specialist, project coordination, financial management, uh, project ma manager, and so on. <laughs> uh, you, you can find, as I've said, you can find these positions in the bit do document, so yeah. So you, you're going to just review and update your own CV and highlight uh, the experience in project ma ma management and the technology, uh, the technology solutions. And you, you're going to just edit that. And yeah, you, that's going to be your task two. And for task three, uh, it's just uh, uh, like creating the project budget. So the bridge the project budget breakdown you can use ai in order to just uh, plan and uh, plan the budget and uh, do a future for, for the financial forecast for the future and you you can just uh, edit that, that one in order to align with the beat and just uh, identify the costs including the personal the equipment and the material and the overhead and just estimate the cost for each co component on historical da data. And I think this one is also uh, provided. So you can use that in order to forecast the future by using AI. I think we have seen the old uh, week six or week five. So it's going to be, uh, it's not going to be a new thing for, for you guys. Yeah, so is this, is this clear, guys? Okay, Gitari and uh, Injala, Pyramsa, Tostan. 
at our address. <laughs> okay. Okay, I'm going to take that as a yes. Uh, so, yeah. So that's pretty much it. So for task one, for the interim submission, you're going to be submitting the task one, the bit document, the your, your first draft of the bit document, and any progression of uh, other tasks. So this is for task one, but if you have, this is just the minimum requirement. And if you have uh, done uh, the rest, you can also su submit it. And on Saturday, you're going to be submitting all of your tasks. I believe this is task three. Yeah. And the final submission is going to be your final. The first the interim was your uh, draft. And the final is going to be your final uh, bit, the completed bit do do documents, include all the CVs and the budget in a tabular format. so uh that's it so this could be uh you can submit all this in a single uh document and on the session side uh, this was the introduction to the challenge and in the afternoon we can we will have uh, understanding the provided reference to document in the tor and tomorrow, you in the afternoon of again, you're gonna have uh, preparing bid documents with Reddit and uh, project planning, uh, project budget planning with EIA. And on Thursday morning, we're gonna have a and a session. Yeah, so you can go uh, through these references for more information and make sure to just go through the data we have provided the nine documents uh, to help you understand more and you can use ai generative ai tools of course um so that's a quick introduction to the challenge uh, so any questions or is it clear Okay. Uh, any questions, guys? Uh, I think it's better to ask now if there is any questions. If there are any questions, please ask. Yes. Uh, I think you mic. Uh, for our CV, are we going to submit our CV as part of the challenge? Yes, yes. Uh, you're gonna submit your CV, but you're gonna make it. You you're gonna edit uh, your CV to make it align with uh, being a project manager. So review and update your CV to highlight uh, relevant experience in project management and technological solution. So you're gonna update it. So uh, just consider that you are already a project manager and you can just add this to your existing cv and uh, edit it oh okay thank you okay. Uh, thank you thank you any other questions okay let me go through the message so uh Okay, so then, so for the others, um, as I have mentioned earlier, you can you have to go through the uh, beat the Tinder the, the TOR in order to find the expertise the list. Sorry, the list of expertise that are required, and you're gonna come up with the CVs yourself. So you 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 can imagine that you have a team, and you're gonna be uh, collecting their CVs. Which align with these uh, requirements, of course. Yeah, from side, just as I have explained, like uh, you, you, you're not going to physically co collect them. You're just going to uh, come up with, with them. So your team is going to have uh, the specification that are. Uh, that are li listed in the, the TOR 
So you're going to come up with the cities and make sure that they are in line with the requirements. Is that clear? OK, good. So more patience, guys, please. I think this is uh, an interesting project. So you're going to be, I believe, um, you're, you're going to be using giant AI more and more uh, for every week. So I believe this is interesting. So who is interested? Who is hyped for this week's project? OK, <laughs> only three people. OK, four people. OK, so uh, if there is no question, uh, we can wrap it up. But I wish there was more, because um, the challenge introduction is nor normally where uh, we share and ask about the projects more to, to get more insights. But uh, I think everyone has a clear image. Uh, so that's good. Let me just stop the recording. And thank you.